Have you ever wondered how Drew Ferrati create these eye-catching motion graphics in his videos? Today, I'm gonna show you how to create this style of motion graphics, how you can create it, and how easy it is to create all inside of After Effects. <laughs> Okay, so what we'll be needing here is the news article, which is from the Indian Express. And we're gonna copy some of this text and information from this. We're gonna build the entire web page in After Effects. So we'll be needing textures and overlays, which I have already downloaded from the internet, which is a white paper texture and a dust overlay, a PNG logo for this Indian Express logo. And let's create a new composition and build this entire thing. Okay, so let's rename this main comp or whatever name you want. I'll keep it at five seconds. Hit OK. First things first, let's drag in the background texture and scale it down to fit the composition. So secondly, I'm gonna import the Indian Express logo, which is on top of this, scale it down. And I'm gonna turn on this title action save and move it up somewhere here. All right, the next thing we're gonna need is the text, which is from this website, the Indian Express. And what I'm gonna do is copy this bold text, copy this, and I'm gonna select the text tool, and I'm gonna set it at Arial and bold, and draw a box here and paste it and you might want to increase the text size all right once you're done with the main headline i'm going to go back in this news article and i'm going to copy this written by asia roy copy this and text which is this paste it and i might want to lower the size of this text to around 40 or maybe 35 okay and change this to regular and I'm gonna copy another text which is New Delhi the date and the place copy that and you can paste it in this second line and adjust this gaps between this and you might want to even scale it down if you want it's something like this all right so the main content is somewhere down here and I'm gonna copy few lines so I'm gonna copy this and move this aside and grab the text tool and drop box here and you know paste it and you can even reposition somewhere else and you can change the size of this text and make some gaps Let's go and animate the highlighted text here. So that's very easy to create. Grab the pen tool, which is this, and we don't you don't need any fills. So you can select this and X that out, and stroke of yellow. And I'm gonna draw a highlight somewhere between violence till here. Okay. Hold down Shift and click here that will give you a perfect straight line. So once you are done with that, you can see it's very straight. So I'm gonna go to the effects and presets and search for rough and edges, drag and drop this rough and edges here. Select this line layer, go to the blending mode and set this to multiply. And you can see through the text like this, okay? So let's go ahead and collapse this and select this add and add a trim path we're gonna animate this okay so collapse this trim path and set this to zero move the time indicator somewhere here set a keyframe for the end and move forward a few frames and set it back to 100 select all the keyframes f9 for easy ease and if you play back you have this okay so you have to duplicate this Control d to duplicate the layer and you can move it with the arrow keys you can always go inside this contents and shape and path and you can grab this point and you can extend or make it short you know i'm gonna select both these layers hit u on the keyboard you can see the animation starts at the same time so i want this second line to 
start a little bit after the first, okay? So I'm gonna drag it away, and if I play it back, that's very nice, okay? We have built the animation, and let's go ahead and create a new solid. And we're gonna build the overlays here, okay? So select this around the rectangle tool and draw around the rectangle. Make sure you cover the entire content here. Go to the mask and set this to subtract and hit F to bring up the feather and you can feather it around 20. I'm gonna go to the project panel and I'm going to drag and drop this dust overlay just below the solid layer. So right now you can see a black background with white dots. So we're gonna invert that. So that's very easy to do. Go to the effects and presets and type in invert. Drag and drop this invert on top of that layer. You can see here. And change the blending mode to multiply. And you can see some dust of this. Next thing is this is very static. We're gonna move it around. So let's create a new null object. And I'm gonna hit P on the keyboard. Hold down Alt on the keyboard and click on this top watch and type in wiggle and inside the bracket two comma and five. You can see the the null object is moving around constantly here. So we're gonna link this all this content except for the dust overlay to the null. So select all the layers, pick whip to the null. So if you play it back now, you can see some movement in the entire content. So all right, let's create a new adjustment layer. And we're gonna give a TV effect here, okay? So go to the effects and presets and type in bat. So, so I'm gonna use this bat TV to old, drag and drop it on the adjustment layer. And right away you can see, go to the effects and controls, say change, change this width height to zero. So creating this kind of motion graphics takes a lot of time to find the assets because you need a very high quality assets to make this. All right, so it takes forever to find free assets online to build this kind of motion graphics. So to make that easier, I use AE Juice, which is this. If I go to the all frame constructor pack, you have all the dust and scratches and you have the overlays, flim burns and frames. You don't have to create this manually. You have all the frames inside here. And also you have a bunch of other video assets here if you buy the all-in-one bundle i have a discount for you you can check that out from the description down below i hope this video is helpful thanks a lot for watching this is motion designer and i will see you in my next video take care